So today is my first full day of working with the Pulsar 23 uh, and I've been setting up MIDI. So MIDI. So I've got over here to the right I've got my MacBook which is running Ableton and the MIDI is coming out through the Tascam and into the back of the Pulsar 23. I've also got this keyboard, the Mini Lab, which um, I'm using these knobs to control some settings on LFOs in Ableton. So this is the setup that I've got in Ableton. I've got an instrument rack here, which allows me to have these macro knobs, buttons, that I can set parameters to and then control using the external knobs on the mini lab. There's an external instrument in this instrument rack and this is set to send MIDI out on channel one um, via the mixer, the Model 12, to the Pulsar 23. And then there are four LFOs in this instrument rack and I've set the offset rate and depth of each LFO to be controlled by these macros and then I've set the MIDI up of these macros to accept the controller values coming from the mini lab. I can control the rate, depth and offset using the mini lab knobs. Then each of the LFOs via this max for live plugin which is called CC Out. I'll put the link in the description. Uh, very useful little plugin that allows you to send continuous controllers CC output from Ableton. So this LFO is controlling this knob which is sending out values on CC22 uh, and those are the, the values that are going to the controller in, the, the four controller ins on the Pulsar 23. So four LFOs that I can control from the keyboard, from the mini lab, that then control four parameters or more on the Pulsar. So that's all, all seems to be working well. Mm-hmm. 